one thing about birthdays is gifting and celebrating but when it comes to these very important and special days for our loved ones and friends the difficulty comes in choosing what to actually gift them or actually celebrate with them and for the men who have uh, so often been gifted with socks and uh, other basic items where the ladies receive chocolates and flowers i think birthday celebrations and gifting should just go beyond these and be more intentional uh, just going deeper rather than just scraping the surface therefore this episode is going to highlight on the things to consider when buying birthday gifts having this consideration in mind you're going to be more intentional and you're going to be uh, more purposeful with your gifting and your celebrating with your loved ones or friends' birthday so here is the first one the first consideration is their needs now you a need is basically a necessity for example if they need um if their light bulb went out but they haven't bought a new one that means they need a light bulb but they just haven't bought a new one so you, your intentionality will be seen if you buy them a new light bulb uh, if they need to go visit their family but they don't have bus fare and you buy them a ticket that is intentionality for based on their need secondly is their interests uh, stroke their favorites or likes whatever they like whatever they enjoy whatever they are so much interested in for example if they love music they are so much interested in music uh, you could probably create for them a playlist you could probably uh, go with them for a concert you know if they love to explore and travel you could book a trip with them and the third one is consider their career and this is more important because most people actually forget about this and just think about the rest other aspects of life but career is also important because this is what this particular person probably relies on for their um, income right so in the aspect of career you can actually do something to foster their career for example if they have a baby and their baby uh, like they don't have a babysitter so they are most of the time held back at home and they are not able to go out and say attend a training attend a conference or even just go around and drop application letters or sit an exam you know to just complete the education and maybe uh, continue with their career journey you can be that person who uh, offers their time and sacrifices your time to be there for them and say watch the baby as they go and apply for particular jobs or as they go and attend a seminar or they go and attend a training uh, the fourth one is consider their talents right now if they are talented in music they play say a guitar they play the ukulele they play the piano you can either say um, or they are interested in that aspect but they don't for example they don't know how to play the guitar but they would like to because they love music you can get them a trainer or buy them a guitar or give them a piano training you know such like things if they are talented in painting you can actually buy them uh, canvases you can uh, take their art at work for exhibition um you can buy them paint brushes paint uh get them a painting room that would be dope and actually basically when it comes to talents that is creativity so if you can have the chance to give this person a creative room sort of a studio that would be the best way to do and the fifth and final one is actually consider their wishes now this has to do with you really being so intentional and listening to 
your friend or your loved one whenever they are talking whenever you guys are conversing you really listen to them and you just get to understand their wishes like what is this person's wishes deep down uh say they wish that they would own something that they are not able to own and it is probably something that they really need if you can afford or if you can sacrifice some of the money to just to make them happy just to make their day that would be a good way to gift them in their birthday if they uh it's almost repetitive with their needs but then if they wish to miss their if they miss their family and you know they wish to see them you could probably say speak to their if they miss the mom if they miss the sister depending on the family member that they miss you can reach out to their family for them to show up say as a surprise during their birthday and that would be really dope um that's it those are the five things to consider when buying a uh, birthday gifts or when celebrating birthdays and i hope you have uh you know picked one or two here and there so that we stop buying socks and flowers and chocolates because these things go far beyond that that is it for this episode i will see you in the next one